What's up, you guys? Today we're going to be talking about multiplying fractions. Um, our first example we're going to do is going to be 1 half times 6 sevenths. And so whenever we multiply fractions, we don't have to look at just the denominator. We can look at everything. And what we're going to do is we're just going to literally multiply right across. So for this first example, we have 1 half times 6 sevenths. Let's go to multiply 1 by 6, we're going to get 6, let's multiply 2 by 7, 14. Now we know we can simplify this by dividing by 2 over 2, which is the same as by 1, but we're going to divide both sides by 2. It's going to give us 3 7 so that's our answer. Also, when doing this, it's helpful sometimes to look at the um, diagonals um, and the equations. So in this case, you could have already simplified this by dividing by 2 over 2 and getting a 3. And a 1, and this would just be 1 times 3 is 3, 1 times 7 is 7, 3, 7. So if you can simplify before, do that. And if, like, likewise, if these simplify, then you can by all means do that. Second example, we are going to do 3 halves times 6 ninths. So before we start this problem again, let's see if we can simplify. Um, and it looks like we can. As you can see, we have a very nice 9 and a 3, which we can divide by 3 on both sides. And we can get, let me just get across this out, we're going to get a 1, we divide by 3, and we're going to get a 3, we divide by 3. So now our new problem is 1 half times 6 thirds. I'm looking at this, I'm like, wait, we can simplify this 6 and this 2. This is going to give us a 3, and this is going to give us a 1. New problem is 1 over 1 times 3 over 3, which is going to equal 3 over 3, or 1. And so if you go in your calculator and you plug this in, you'll see that these are, um, when multiplied together, they give you 1, and yeah, that's multiplying fractions. Big takeaways. Are Multiply across and two. Check for simplification. Thanks, guys.